Hi guys, 732 Review Crew back. I am Mikey. I'm Joe. And I'm Mike. And we are back today with Buffy the Vampire Slayer Season 3, Episode 15. It's Pi Day, but it's Consequences. Wow, Episode 15. God damn. Yeah, 314 is Pi Day. Oh. Anyways. Anyways. <laughs> I don't know numbers. Uh, that's right, 3.14. But we're going to keep on going with these episodes as we see what Consequences mean. Do you guys remember what happened last episode? Uh, it Faith, wasn't Pi Day. <laughs> Faith killed somebody. Oh, yeah. yeah. Maybe like, actually what... murdered a human being. We might be dealing with those consequences right now. I don't remember. Also, I, I found that death actually really funny because he was so deathly afraid of the mayor. <laughs> and he was just, like, cowering by a dumpster. And he's like, hey, excuse me, Miss Slay. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, God. yeah. Such an unfortunate yeah. death. But I'm ready right. to yep. jump into this one, see what it's about. We're starting in three, two, one. Thank you for joining us. Huh. It's a dream. Is that the other new watcher? No, that's the, the dude who made the Yeah. That was weird. Nightmare. I gotta bust out my dream translation journal. Do you have one of those? No? I guess you could say Buffy is drowning in guilt. Thanks. Mikey doesn't appreciate me. The slain man was identified as deputy mayor. Oh, he was the deputy mayor? Yeah, yeah. What? I didn't know he was title. Oh, okay. I promise you I will not rest until whoever did this is found and brought to justice. Thank you very much. Oh, it's just terrible, isn't it? It is, but it's like the 15th person who died on that day in Sunnydale, so. The deputy mayor's murder was the result of human malice. Nothing supernatural about it. We don't know that for certain. I say it merits investigation. Which I'm sure the police are doing. In the meantime, if you ask me, there are better uses for the Slayer's time. Ah, but I don't believe I did ask you. Considering the success of your previous adventure. <laughs> don't let me interrupt. Wait, let me interrupt. I'm in a hurry. What did you know? Will it? <laughs> Sir, she's a student. <laughs> New watcher. Oh. Does everybody know about you? She's a friend. Let's not exaggerate. Mm -hmm. So, you're the new watcher. Wesley Wyndham Price. I like a man with two last names. <laughs> I'm Cordelia. And you teach psychology. I take psychology. <laughs> well. Yeah! <laughs> Thank you. Here to watch. Girls. Uh, uh, Buffy and Faith, to be specific. Bro! Smooth fucking operator. So, welcome to Sunnydale. Yeah. Is Xander gonna fight the wall? How old is he supposed to be? 30s, 40s? Cheeky, isn't she? Uh, first word jail, second word bait. I love Faith. <laughs> I'm your commander now, and on the matter of this murder, I'm resolved. Natural or super, I want to know. Fine by me. I love that he's ignoring what happened last episode. So, you're gonna rat me out? Is that it? Faith, we have to tell. I can't pretend to investigate this. I can't pretend that I don't know. Oh, oh. I see, but you can pretend that Angel's still dead when you need to protect him. Ooh! Ooh. Look, if, if we don't do the right thing, it's only gonna make things worse for you. Worse than jail for the rest of my young life? No way. Faith, what we did was... Yeah, it? we. You were right there beside me when this whole thing went down. Anything I have to answer for, you do too. What the hell? I mean, she was an accomplice, so... Blackmail! Like, I'm taking you down with me. She didn't do anything. She was just... She was just a witness who didn't confess. Yeah, that's an accessory. Yeah. To me, Why is Willa dressed like Chucky? It was the fashion of the time. I'm meeting Michael, the warlock guy. Yeah. Well, you, that fans. was shitty. Willow took it personally when she... I mean, yeah. ...snubbed her last episode, so... Damn, there's like a full investigation for a murder for once? Well, yeah, because he was killed by a non-monster. Maybe eight. 
Angel. All right. Do they not see him over there? Just lurking. Oh, he's had years to work on his lurking skills. It's called brooding. He's going to think Buffy did it. He is going to think Buffy did it. The deputy mayor had wooden splinters in his wound. Oh. Word is someone was fighting vampires not a block away from the scene. Wow. This is exciting. A slayer up for murder one. That's sunshine and roses to me. It really is. He's a creep. Yeah. He's good, though. Shredding paper makes me happy. It brings me joy. I mean, mood. Have you used an industrial one that does like 10 at a time? Or 20? No. Curry. Oh, the ones that you can do like credit cards through and stuff like that? Yeah, it looks fun. My dad had one. <laughs> you know what? Let's just blow. Who cares what this guy was about? It's kind of moot now, don't you think? I don't think he was in that alley by chance. I think he was looking for us. I'd like to know why. So what, you think there's some big conspiracy? Bobby Smart. You were saying... I like how being a slayer is also like being a spy. Stealth. So the mayor of Sunnydale is a black hat. It's a shocker, huh? Actually, yeah. It's, it's a black hat. guy vibe off of. It doesn't matter what kind of vibe you get off a person, because nine times out of ten, the face they're showing you is not the real one. Ooh, foreshadowing. About that. Ooh. What is that supposed to mean? Less than 24 hours ago, you killed a man. And now it's all zippity doo -dah. It's not your real face, and I know it. Look, I know what you're feeling because I'm feeling it too. Do you? Like something sick creeped inside you and you can't get it out. And you keep hoping that it was just some nightmare, but it wasn't. Wow. Uh, we're gonna... <laughs> just let me talk to Giles, okay? I swear. No, we're not bringing anybody else into this. I missed the mark last night, and I'm sorry about the guy. I really am. But it happens. Anyways, how many people do you think we've saved by now? Thousands? Because in my book, that puts you and me in the plus column. We help people. It doesn't mean we can do whatever we want. Why not? But what if he was coming to us for help? What if he was? <sighs> I was. Can't they resurrect him? We were built to kill. To kill mm -hmm. demons. Can't they just resurrect him? But it does not mean that we get to pass judgment on people like we're better than everybody we else. We are better. need us to survive fucking but homelander else, dude nobody's gonna cry over some random bystander who got caught in the crossfire i am that's your loss friendship with buffy ended for now so, so black hat means like the government or people in power are staging their own is like incidents and whatever like they're they're causing their own problems so she recognized mr trick and that's the investigator. Tell me again. You got home at what time last night? Some old movie. Infomercial. Oh. That's funny. Because I got a couple of witnesses who put you near the alley. The strange thing is, the weapon? It was made out of wood. Why is everything coming crashing down right now? Why do I feel like this is the whole Angel show? It's just Angel in the background like that. Uh, stuff goes on. It's just the angel in the background. Like, he is the watcher. No, it's. Good. I think you guys will like it. It's good. I mean, I fondly that's remember. That's a pretty sick lava I, I fondly remember one story in particular that was really good. I want to be fester free. Same. Yeah. Teach me. Do. If you guys work together, you, you should get along. It's more complicated than that. But see, it's that exact oh, don't tell thing Willow. that's ticking me off. It's this whole slayers only attitude. Y you talk to me about everything. It's like all of a sudden, I'm not cool enough. What? Because I can't no. do things with my bare hands. <laughs> oh, oh, Buffy, don't cry. Oh, she's that's so cute. Because she said kill it's stuff with your bare hands. I it triggered her. And Faith acts like she doesn't even care. The way she talks, it's like she didn't even make a mistake. You have to go to Giles, Buffy. He'll know what to do. Damn right. Not his house? A library at midnight? He actually lives at the library now because he's a librarian and not a watcher anymore. They were paying for his house. <laughs> Why is the school open this late? 
This is the first time you're asking that? Come on. I don't really know how to say this. So, um, um, I'm just gonna say it. Anybody else here? Oh, shit. But I I've been oh. blowing off my classes. I told him. It looks like she flipped it. He had to know what you did. What Ooh. Did That's called. Just no. That's just not what happened. I don't want to hear it, Buffy. Faith, I'll talk to you in the morning. Just please, you have to. No. That's cold. Faith. Yo. <laughs> Listen to her. Let her talk. Sorry. What the fuck? Faith is running away now, isn't she? That's cold. Wow. That's fucked up. But the murder, it, it Faith, was. Faith, I know. Oh, he knows. He's not dumb. Thank God. She may have many talents, Buffy, but fortunately, lying is not. Bad. Ah. Plus. Bless it. I needed her to think that I was on her side. I don't know how far she'll take this charade. It's not. The Slayer is on the front line of a nightly war. I mean, it's, it's tragic, but accidents have happened. What do you do? Well, the council investigates, um, meets out punishment if punishment is due, but I, I have no plan to involve them. I mean, it's the last thing Faith needs at the moment. So, so then we, we just have to help her deal, right? She's in denial. There is no help for her until she admits what happened. I mean, it, it may be that they're seeing a different side of her. No one else is to know. Who heard? Who heard? Of course. I mean, this is extremely delicate. Uh oh. What's he doing there? Getch. On the council. Fuck he, you. He, he's waiting for them to finish Hate renovating him. Giles's uh, old home, you know? Well, I can be the one, on her one. Let's rephrase. I think she might listen to me. We kind of have um, a connection. No, I, I don't see it that way. I mean, of all of us, <laughs> one person, arguably, that Faith has had the least contact with. Yeah, but we hung out a little recently, and she seemed to be um, responsive. When did you guys hang out? Oh, she was fighting one of those. Uh, Apocalypse demon things, and I helped her. Gave her a ride home. And you guys talked? Not extensively. Oh, is he admitting this? Then why would you. Well, uh. uh oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to say, oh, I got it before. <laughs> Yikes. Yikes. Fine, fine. <laughs> I know that you mean well. She doesn't take the guys that she has a connection with very seriously. And they're they're kind of a big joke to her. No offense. <gasps> oh no. I don't know. I need time. Yeah, there's like no cohesion in the group right now. Yeah, they feel off. Well, I was trying to be careful with Oz, but she's obviously jealous about Xander. Oh, damn. God, I hate that color. Yeah, that bathroom sucks. And the school's so nice. What's he bumming out about? He thought it meant, meant something. Oh, and it didn't. Gotcha. Uh, Giles? No. W Wesley? Is that his name? I can't remember his name. The guy, the British guy? Watch Council. Him. Xander! Pretty much not gonna try to take you. Under Is it gonna happen again? I heard about what happened, and I thought you might need a friend. So then go talk to Buffy. She's the one who killed a guy. Yeah, I heard that verse. Faith, you may not think so, but I sort of know you. That you're, um, like a wild thing, and half the time, you don't know what you're doing. And you're living proof of that, aren't you? See? You can try to hurt me, but right now you need someone on your side. Oh. You'd dig that, wouldn't you? To get up in front of all your geek pals and go on record about how I made you my boy toy for a night. You just came by here because you want another taste, don't you? No. I mean, it was nice. Mm -hmm. It was great. Okay. Someday, sure, sure, yay. But not now. I came here to help you. I just, he's, he's being real good right now. I thought we had a connection. 
Mm. Oh my god, wait, is she gonna... I could die. Matter of fact, That's ominous uh, as fuck. She needs therapy. She's on the border of like three separate felonies right now. Angel! Hey, Angel! It's a, it's a hotel, so he's allowed in. Dude, this, <laughs> this is Batman episode. This is Angel. I hope this is what the this Angel is show's like. Batman Imagine this what the Angel show is like. He's just like whacking, saving people. I wouldn't know anything about it, so I don't know. I hope so too. I always knew you weren't really a one slayer guy. Sorry about the chains. It's not that I don't trust you. Actually, it is that I don't trust you. I bet you're not big on trust games now, are you, Faith? Can you shrink me now? Uh, oh my god! No. Age is gonna be the one to make her pass. A long panning shot. Oh, Buffy's over there, okay. It's like talking to a wall. Only you get more from a wall. Because she killed a man. It changes everything for her. Giles said with counseling, they might not even need to lock her up. That's not what I mean. Yeah, you change, and you, yeah. She's taken a life. She's got a taste for it now. Huh? Not one slayer, but two. Yeah, maybe they aren't as good at sneaking as I thought. We don't have near enough evidence to put them away. No? You're gonna have to come up with a more efficient solution. And Mr. Trick, you better think of it soon. I mean, to kill without remorse is to feel like a god. Right now, all I feel is a cramp in my wrist. So let me go! But you're not a god. You're not much more than a child. You're going down this wow. path will ruin you. He's using his torture powers for good. Yeah. Time was, I thought humans existed just to hurt each other. But then I came here. And I found out that there are other types of people. People who genuinely wanted to do right. And they make mistakes. And they fall down. Yeah, but they keep caring. Keep trying. You don't have to disappear into the darkness. Oh. Uh-oh. What? Oh, the council? What the fuck's going on here? It's the council trying to... No, I got that part. Okay. What? They were just taking her into their custody. Uh, that's so funny. how they find him? Also... Everyone was okay with Angel? What's the net do? What do you mean? All the council guys were like, yep, just gonna beat this guy up. That's a vampire because he ran away from my cross. I'm sorry for the extreme measures. Are they in a glory? Oh my god. This is so British. Ah, uh, no, none of that. Tighten her restraints. Hey, there's no point in fighting this. I have to disagree with you on that one. Wow. I'll pop this guy's head like a grape. Yeah, he's an idiot for doing this. Yeah. Don't even think about it. He's a terrible watcher. He's terrible. Thought she was about to fucking. You can't keep running. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Bop. Run again, Wes. Jump out the moving car. Wild car, bitches. <laughs> I love that. That was good. That was good, Mikey. <laughs> <laughs> My weakness, Annette! <laughs> it's draped in holy water. I hate to say it, but maybe she belongs behind bars. Ooh. She's out of control, I know. But Angel was getting somewhere with her. She was opening up. If we could just stop Wesley. That's no longer an issue. I was trying to save her. But you didn't. You probably destroyed her. Yeah, I think Fate's gonna be pushed to be an evil slayer now. Anti-slayer. What can I do? I want to help. Still got your ticket back to the mother country? Woo! She did talk about that freighter that we got all day. freighter. Two a day. Two a day. Two a day. Where is she? That's a nice freighter. I don't know enough about freighters to comment. Based not on that freighter. Better check the other one. Where's security? It's the docks. You don't give up, do you? No, she was on that freighter. Faith, 
Faith, nobody is asking you to be like me. But you can't go on like this. You, Faith, you're hurting people. You're hurting yourself. That's not it. That's not what bothers you so much. What bugs you is you know I'm right. You know in your gut. We don't need the law. We are the law. Faith, you're sick. I've seen it be. You've got the lust. And I'm not just talking about screwing vampires. Don't you dare bring him into this. It was good, wasn't it? The sex, the danger. I had a party we even dug him when he went psycho. Wow. Tempts you. You know it could be you. Woo Fight. Fire fight. No, I'm not gonna do this. Why not? Feels good. Blood rising. Oh, oh. Buffy got hit. <gasps> oh, the trap! Mr. Trick is so smart! That's why you never split the party. I'm Buffy. It's just, you know, thousands of pounds of crates. Oh my god, he's powerful. Yeah, he seems like he might be tricky to defeat. Shut up, Joe. Where'd that barrel come from? She put it on his head. Wow, he's dangerous. Crash straps. Jesus Christ. I hear once you've tasted a slayer, you never want to go back. Wow, she... Oh, Mr. Trick. Oh, no. No, this is no good at all. No, I liked him kind of. Save my life. I mean, Buffy did literally just save her life like moments before, so. Yeah. Okay, but this is more profound. Yeah. So she saved you. She could have left me there to die, Giles, but she didn't. I'm not gonna give up on her. Oh. Oh no! What? You sent your boy to kill me. That's right, I did. He's dust. I thought he might be, what with you standing here and all. <laughs> I guess that means you have a job overnight. What? 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 Yeah, that was a hell of a twist. Wow. Okay, so she is the evil slayer right now. What? That's an interesting twist. So she's literally going to, unless she's going to be deep undercover, she's now working for the mayor, who we know is like a demon of some sort, I believe, or some person who has contracts with demons. And that means she's working for the other side now. That's actually not a terrible theory because she could be doing that because she feels like she needs to right some wrongs, maybe. Which is fair. Um, but still do it her own way kind of thing. I could see it. You know? Uh, I, what do you think? You think she's evil or she's or undercover? She, she's not evil. Or she's just still going down the wrong path. It's fair. I think she's lost without a cause and going to work for the mayor will allow her to be her own law while also subconsciously being like, hey, I'll know what the mayor is doing. I think it's not, it's like a layered thing like that. Because there's no way she just is like, I'm going to go work for the main so, villain. Like, that's... It's interesting. That would be awful writing. No, I, I agree. Uh, unless it's some sort of, like, she has some sort of motive in mind that's beyond just going to be evil for being the sake of that she now enjoys murdering people. Because there was a whole discussion that obviously that her and Angel had where he's like, you can't enjoy murdering people. We have to bring her back from like that because she's toting that very fine line that Joe said of Yeah, being I mean, she Homelander. was about to kill Xander questionably. Yeah, yeah. And also, Joe doesn't love villains. He hates villains. So there's no way that he, that Faith is a villain. Uh, I don't know about that. Oh, he likes bad girl. Okay. What is that? Is that true? What villains do I hate? I love the Joker. Anyways, um, so baseless accusations. Baltar. Um, he's not a villain. He is a villain. No, he's not. I'm sorry. Um, you hate him. So back to this though, we have a interesting, you know, revelation with this episode where. Xander reveals to everybody that and he, everyone's like oh well because he thought he, he thought he had some sort of, <laughs> of like you know extra brownie points because of what he did with her where he could be like ah we have a connection you know i could talk to her in reality she, it was like it didn't matter it her. didn't matter i mean she literally <laughs> was like I'll, i i mean okay. if i want I'll, i can kill you right now and Seemed like she took him pretty close. She was going to. We're on the cusp I, of it. I thought it was interesting because Xander was actually controlling his urges very well and being very rational about everything. And I think that just made Faith want it more, kind of. He only went there with good intentions. Yes. yes. And I'm glad that he stayed with the way he did. But I'm also glad that Angel saved him because I'm pretty sure he, she was going to kill him. Yeah, he, I keep forgetting which, he doesn't need an invitation. Yeah, well, it was a hotel. Motel. Yeah. 
public dwelling. Um, so, I mean, we also had Willow dealing with the fact of learning about that, which was interesting because she's, as we know, as of right now, is still trying to get back with Oz or dating Oz. And Yeah, they're dating. But she has still has emotions for uh, Sander, obviously, because she yeah, got that was jealous. Clearly. But we also, I mean, the crying alone in the bathroom yeah. is pretty. It was supposed to be rough. emotional. But we yeah. she also had Buffy trauma dump on her. On she top did. Of oh, yeah. It was like. It's just a lot to process. Yeah. yeah. yeah poor Willow. Yeah. You know, I'm glad that they kind of made things better as they kind of um, stopped. You know, they were avoiding each other a little bit. And they kind of. Buffy actually, you know. We, we found the person that she trusts the most, and it's Willow. And this is not Giles, it's Willow, who's number one, which is very interesting because, I mean, obviously it's a girl who really is her closest friend, so it makes sense. Um, but I like how once she talks to Willow, Willow's like, you have to tell Giles, and we get to that whole switcheroo of she did it, not me. Yeah, which was crazy. I mean, Giles is the best dad ever, so he was like, I know she's lying. Well, I liked how he played it off like that, too. I made, it made me mad for a minute. Like I was like, how does he not believe her or let her talk? And then it's just like, nope, I don't. I believe you. Obviously, Faith was lying. We just need to get her out of here because she's not stable. <laughs> Which is crazy. Yeah, yeah. He, he's mm -hmm. consistently been a great character. Uh, I was gonna say, great. totally random. I don't know why I noticed or if it matters. Willow has a different room. Oh, yeah. she? Yeah, she used to live on the second floor. Angel came through a window. Remember? Yeah. But yeah. she has a balcony. What? She's always had a balcony. Did she always yeah. have a balcony? Yeah. I don't remember those doors. Yeah. Yeah. She's wealthy. He's in tight. Yeah. Um, Bless you. He's in tight. I felt like it was totally different. No, she's anyway. balcony. Yeah. Uh, um, so we saw okay. that. The but that so Buffy entered via the balcony. Hmm. Listen, when I came home from school, if I didn't have a key in the front door, I was like, I would go through my second floor. Buffy what just the fuck? doesn't use front doors. You can now. just like reach up to the corner of most houses in the landscaping and just like pull yourself up. Okay, well, don't break into other people's houses. Don't do that. Um, going towards the anyways, uh, sorry, the, the, the just... council. So we saw the council in action, where obviously what happens when a Slayer kills a human is the council takes him back to England and puts him on trial. Now, if it's a ma massive, massive, massive accident, obviously they're going to probably let her go. But in this situation, it seems like what do you they, mean by let her go? It seems like you know you they, mean they, execute her. Well, they, they were they were going to put her in prison or prison, you know, as right I, I feel like. I feel like they were. You were right, Mikey. And they were like, oh, we yeah. threw her in prison for like 30 years. Meanwhile, she, they literally. She fixed. passed from a wasting disorder. Well, I mean, because you can't afford to put a Slayer in jail because there's only one, <laughs> technically. There's supposed to be one. So, like, yeah. putting her in jail is like, oh, guess what? The world's in danger. Not to mention, I loved how much better they were at with dealing with a vampire versus dealing with a slayer oh they literally they like vampire them. cross holy water debt <laughs> <laughs> and slayer they were like fuck <laughs> we messed up <laughs> yeah well, oh. they were like how did that singular chain not hold her <laughs> with one bolt through a wooden board it was foolproof well, but they can't use force. It's not like they can hold her up at gunpoint. They could have put her in a net. Yeah. Maybe. Like a little Pokeball for Slayers. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, um, now that Mr. Trigger... so, do you guys like the new Watcher? He no. fucking he sucks. sucks. He sucks. Fucking Go back to the fatherland or motherland, whatever He's it was. He's the Barning. Okay. Was it motherland, they said? What is mother country? Mother country. Yeah. Motherland and Fatherland are more Eastern European. Yeah. Which I am. Anyways. Um, now, going this back. So but the this mayor, is... Mr. Trick. No, I was saying Mr. Trick actually is dead oh now, which God. I didn't expect him to die this soon. Um, so what I imagine is they're going to be trying to replace him with a villain, which is going to be potentially Mikey. Faith. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, no, I'm but, so but, but I wonder if they're going to replace him with a vampire-style demon, because we had Spike, we had Mr. Trick, we had... Um, the master. And now we have Drew, Faith. Master... I mean, Faith's not a vampire, so... Yeah, but it's no, this murderer is, Faith. No, this is on par for season threes of shows to, like, break the mold of the villain. Okay. I mean, it's, I'll be interested to find out. There's only one way for us to find out. That's to keep watching. I mean, that's a really good foe for Buffy to have to face, dude. It really is, and I can't wait. Slayer v. Slayer? She has more experience, so it's going to maybe come it's out like, It's like the, the dark side copy of you. Yeah, yeah. and yeah. once again, Buffy's like, I don't want to do it, I can't do it. And then she's like... 
I did it. <laughs> well, I would also, one thing I want to bring up, actually, the final thing, I like how the forensic details included that there was splinters in the heart, basically. I like that, too. And, yeah. and the chest and through the heart cavity. And it's like, okay, well, anybody who knows uh, Vampire Slayers knows that's a Vampire Slayer doing that. So it was good tick for that. But, like, any normie is going to be like, what the fuck? What's going on there? It's a spear. Yeah. Bronze Age. Uh, yeah, a spear. All right. Number 732 Rico, I'm Mikey. I'm Joe. And I'm Mike. Thanks for joining us for this episode of Buffy. Enjoy it. Check out our Patreon to a week of this show and soon to be Angel, which I don't know anything about and Joe doesn't let me look at. Uh, otherwise, we'll see you next time. Bye. Toodaloo. Watching you. Bye.